Hi everyone, welcome to my channel, Blue Lotus Gardens. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Blue Phoenix. My pronouns are they, them. If you're new here, welcome. I make plenty videos for my found knowledge and then also share with you a plant vlog. What I do behind the scenes of my uh, home based plant shop, Blue Lotus Gardens. If that's something that you're interested in, um, I recommend subscribing and liking my videos, uh, helping us grow so that way we can reach a, a larger audience. I have merch. I have Proud Plant Parent merch. Uh, I'm gonna. I feel like I'm gonna just coin that, by the way. Um, but that's that's my merch. Um, I did remake this hat, so, so we all know um, it is now a tie dye edition hat. Um, I thought it was more fun that way. It was, this was just like a demo hat that I was trying out, and um, I've received feedback, and then I changed it up. So you know that way we all kind of like enjoy the merch okay so in today's video um so i was going to go i'm going to lowe's to buy um orchid supplies because uh, i'm rescuing those orchids that i was that y'all saw from the last vlog and <laughs> i was first going to go running to, to lowe's and then just like go get picked up afterwards and then i was like no it's a little too hot but then i was like just like uber over there it's like nine dollars right you know i could do that it's fine the bus is like six dollars, a couple more dollars, and I save a little bit of like energy. <laughs> um, so that's how I was thinking. And oh my god, my hair is so messy. Put on the hat, that's why. Ugh. And the, the first first ride was accepted it, but it was like it's twenty three minutes. They're twenty three minutes away, and they were still like doing uh, completing a ride. And I was like, okay, well that's fine. But then they canceled when it was like 17 minutes and i'm like no and then now i have to wait another 23 minutes so that's what i'm doing waiting on my uber so that way i can go get orchid supplies i'm gonna make an orchid video for y'all um and then an orchid uh res plant rescue video you know this is all like from my found knowledge nothing that you could take like that's supposed to be like um to the to the grave like you know i'm not a botanist or anything like that um I just see what I see and I, it, it works for me and I'm, you know, just trying to share it out there and hope it works for other people. I'm going to make a video request that one of our subscribers has requested. You all can request a video. I'll, I'll, um, choose to see if I, I'll do that. Um, I'll do that with y'all, but I'll also take video requests through my Patreon. There's this option where you, uh, tip. And you receive uh, some digital downloads, and um, you can also like get to choose between um, like a video request options and stuff like that. So, if that's something that you like, I would recommend going to my Patreon and uh, looking into it and seeing what you like and what tier works best for you. Um, I appreciate everybody that has supported me on my Patreon. I'm getting that going a little bit more. Um, I have the Plant Club plants going, but yeah. I hope y'all enjoy this video. <laughs> it's gonna be a weird little video and I'm just rambling and I just feel tired a little bit because uh, I've been doing like a lot of work I'm trying to get three platforms going, but hey, it's all worth it. And I super appreciate all of y'all like helping me grow that. It's been amazing, so thank y'all. All right, I made it to my local Lowe's store and they had some really good selections and I want to show y'all like all these right here um I just I'm always amazed by their little displays I really like them and I just like looking at all of them that they have here all these pumpkins there's some chaffleras some ponytail palms get your ponytail palms look at these Ooh. Ooh, are these are yucca plants? Look at this little yucca. I think it fell out. It's mine. <laughs> it's gonna be like, can I have that? Come here. Come home with me. <laughs> I still think this is like an underrated plant, the asparagus fern. I think it's so pretty. Look at that.
Look how pretty that looks. Yo, I'm so ready for like Halloween. Boo. <laughs> I don't want to like dress up, I want to do stuff, I want to like go crazy, oh, well maybe not go crazy, but like, I want to do stuff. I think we've all been like cooked up and cooked up, cooked up, locked up in our <laughs> home so long. Oh my god, look at all this, I just want to decorate my, cre my house, like go, just go wild. I love that. <laughs> So I spotted this, everyone. I'm at my Walmart. Um, and I don't know what to say. Is that, is that, a, is that a, no, right? I don't know. I kinda just wanna buy it just to like see, but I'm thinking it's not. I'm taking it. I don't care. <laughs> I'm gonna see what I can do. It's mine now. So I bought the plant and I just want to share with y'all this little sunset moment. Here's one reason I'm kind of excited to living over here. There's an LGBTQIA plus church. So so I'll be going to that church uh, sometime soon. I want to check it out. I haven't been to church in so long. Um, and so it'd be nice to kind of go. Like, look how pretty that looks. <laughs> All right. Hi, everyone. Welcome to my plant studio. To use a messy hair, I just took a shower. Um, it was hot today. Needed that shower. Anyways, here is my Walmart find. And... I'm gonna tell y'all real quick. I don't care. Look, and it's it was look 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 at that price. Okay, so look at this price, and look at that plant. I'm I don't know yet. I don't know yet what it is. But I will be repotting it. I will be putting it in a song little home. I will be putting it in that grow tent, and I will see some results. Cause either way, like. It's exciting to even try to like go on this journey of like, even if it is, if it's not, I don't even want to say the name because once you say the name, it's done for. Like, no, that's not going to happen to you. But what this is, is a special find. It has a really nice big one right there. And it has a little tiny baby one right here. I'm gonna give you a little closer look. This is the leaf that got me. Okay, this is leaf, y'all. I'm just really excited. Can you can you tell how excited I am? I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I'm just going by. Um, I'm just going by like the, from the research I've done and from the pictures. Leave some comments down below, but don't be mean. I don't. Don't break my heart. I know what it is. It could be. It could be. It could not be. But like, <laughs> just go on this really cool journey of like this might be a special plant that I found. I feel like this is like blessings on blessings on blessings for me. So whatever it is. Whatever it is, it's mine. I'm, it's my special little plant, and I just want to have a little special plant. I don't know. <laughs> I'm just really excited. Okay, well, tomorrow I'm going to repot it, and I'll share with you all. This bed's also going. I sold it on Nextdoor. Thank you so much for buying it. Um, I just need space. I need space for my plants, and... I want to have, I want to have a, um, 
a terrarium back here and I want to start my like terrarium plants and I, I really want to get that going like I know I have a lot of projects going on uh, but I think it's fun I think I think um, this is like a great journey this is good for me um, I'm staying busy and I'm happy and I'm enjoying every single moment that I, I am given from all like all these plants so Thank you. One last thing. This is my parking lot, parking lot plant. Um, I'm telling y'all, the universe is just doing these things where it just gives me these plants. And this is a little yucca, little yucca plant. I found it in the parking lot and I grabbed it. I'm take, I took it home. I don't care. I was walking and I saw it, just like I saw that little ZZ Raven plant. Y'all, here are all my little special cuttings. And there it is. It's rooting for me. It's like the fastest ZZ Raven. Is that a spider? Oh, it's a drowned, drowned spider. I'm so sorry for you, buddy. Um, but those are the roots. They're going. So I'm just really excited. And I have like little Miranda cuttings and begonia cuttings in here as well. So so excited <laughs> all right till tomorrow the next day hi everyone all right so i have an order to pack uh for a local pickup thank you so much for placing an order with me and then it's also cool because like i get to uh, I, I offer plant care so you can also uh, purchase like a one week or two week plant care that also so that's something I try to offer as well show you all the plants that or that she placed so these are the plants um, that were ordered from me little succulent docktail cacti this one's really like popular everybody really likes this one I love it too because it's like it trails and it's um, soft spine so that's cool the string of hearts i'm about to um i'm about to uh place it in its i'm about to place it in its bag and package it up and then two of the tracinas uh for today um uh, today's special i try to add a since i'm only open like three days i try to offer as many deals and specials as i can um because every other day i'm filming or editing so or like working on the website and stuff so Eventually, I'll, I'll get help, right? <laughs> so that's, this is what I'm gonna do. So here is the plant. I misted it because I think it just needed to be hydrated from the, the little roots. So what I'm thinking of, I was actually gonna like make a whole video of me like repotting it and rescuing it but i don't really think this one needs to and um i think what i'm gonna do is just let it hang out in its pot and um get some new growth on top yeah i think i could do this so as you see i sprayed it with that mister that i showed y'all on my vlog last time um and And I'm just gonna place it in my grow tent, and I'm gonna check up on it. I think that's all it really needs to needs to do. I don't think I want to mess with it since they were, they already repotted it. So uh, that's what I'm gonna do. All right, hi everyone. I changed up the plant studio a little bit, and you'll see it. And as you see, um, I just took a shower, and it's really nice to like relax after the day. So I have my Franken Philo here. I'm gonna take it out of this cash pot. So it's currently in this little little pot right here, and as you see, we're going to pull out this little uh, beautiful little uh, philodendron in here as well. It could. A lot of people were saying that it's it could be a, um, a, a red Congo, and I could see why. And it's for it's for the structure of the leaf, as you see here, 
but this leaf also and its immaturity kind of still make me believe that it could be so what i'm going to do is separate them there's a whole bunch of little babies on it as well and then i am going to grow it and see how it matures you know um i think this is kind of cool even if regardless if it is if it isn't um it's cool just kind of going to the process of what it could be so let's get to repotting it and i'll show you all how i split uh split it up so that way you all will see how to do it yourself as well all right so i have my little container here so i can make a mess inside of it and won't make too much of a mess in my room uh, I'm trying to keep it a little bit cleaner right now so I don't have to clean it up as much after the video. And you're going to see a lot of your plants um, arriving from great big box stores always have more peat moss and that's because of the way they're transferred from one location to another location. It's uh, different um, than like purchasing on a, um, from a, from an online plant shop like us. Um, your plants will be in a more of a uh, of a uh, regular mix, regular general potting mix. It's it won't be a heavy potting mix. This is just so that way it's like big box stores use this, so it's easier for maintenance and also transportation. So it's a little something so y'all know. I I will admit, and in, in the past I was kind of that person that was like, ew, why is it so soggy and da 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 da. But then you just realize it is what it is, and the purpose it purpose is really to like benefit everybody. So that's really how to go about it. So I am going to. Oh well, there it goes. It generally would just like fall out on its own um, because it's peat moss. It's easier, and your your roots won't get as damaged as if, um, let's say, if you were in, it had a regular uh, potting mix. In my opinion, ever going to split up a plant like like a philodendron birkin, uh, you want to always start from the bottom in like the inner inner side of it. There's a part of it where they're all meet together, and that's where you'll start to untangle the roots. Um, and from there, you'll just untangle all of the plants themselves. We'll have root breakage. Um, it's just it's just how it's going to happen and then you just wiggle it out like so trying to be as careful as possible I hope my audio is on point this time sometimes with this mic it's really good but like I don't know it'll just make a it'll make my voice go really deep <laughs> really really deep and it's weird it's kind of scary weird and if it does, well, here's a scare repot. <laughs> so I think I've binge watched all my Netflix shows and also all my HBO Max shows. So if anybody can give me a good recommendation on a show to watch, it's usually how I uh, do my editing. I'll just watch a show. So if y'all know of a really good show to watch, let me know. Because I love like good shows that I can just binge watch all the time. All right, this one's coming undone. Try to be as gentle as I can with the roots. Oh, ho, ho, ho. buddy, 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 buddy. Those roots are pink. I'm just going to say that. Those roots are pink. Another one like right in here and I so want to just pop it out. But I don't even know if these guys will make it if I pop them out.
So we got a whole bunch of little babies. There's this one. There's this one. There's this one. This little guy too. I might have lost a leaf or two. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. They might have been a little bit too young to pull out. But, you know, I think I feel comfortable enough to do this on my own. This is not a recommendation to do it on. If you feel comfortable doing this, go for it. I feel comfortable doing this. So that's why I'm doing it. Plus, it's a it's an experiment that I really want to like work with, and um, I will definitely be posting a lot of like updates on my Discord group. Um, it's a uh, my Discord group is Plant Chat, so I just this is just like my general Discord group where everybody can like like they can just talk and chat about plants and ask for IDs if you if you like, um, and. Um, you know, it's just, it's 18 over, I like, uh, want to keep it very general, uh, for everybody. So, uh, just on that note, cool. So I'm going to repot them into another little, little pot like that. Um, this one is going to go in here. I gotta tell y'all, those roots are, are pink. I'm just saying it could be and I really hope it could it is but you know either way it's I'm happy with whatever it is the little ones I'm going to be putting into a little container of their of their own and they're going to be grown like um, in this I don't have little tiny pots um, at the moment I completely ran out so I might look let me see if I can find one all right okay so I kind of found some pots I don't know working with what I got um, here's this one I'm going to be using for um, this baby little guy right here I know it's really big for it but it's all I have at the moment There you go. So I'm gonna place them in there for now. And then let's just hope I get some little pots soon so I can uh, do something with that. Next, I'm going to uh, place the larger, maybe pink dude. Um, the maybe pink dude uh, into this little container. I don't know, what do y'all think?
I don't know if 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 philodendrons, philodendron birkins are hard for y'all to repot, but like, they're so hard for me to repot sometimes. Like, I don't know. So I just kind of <laughs> was having a little hard time doing that. It's almost like if there was like a Lekka situation going on. Look at these little babies, y'all. So cute. Mm. This is how I have it. I'm trying to like show it to y'all where. Can... Okay, so y'all can see there. Let's just keep it watered and that will just um, help keep it moist and until they grow like to be, be bigger and ready to be potted up. I could have done that with this one also, but whatever. It is, it is what it is. Okay. So here is what I did. I have a maybe pink dude right here. I have some little Birkins right over here. I have a little baby pink dude right over here, maybe pink dude. Um, and then I have this little Birkin over here as well. I think this is all fun. I um, enjoy this. So this was my repot um, of uh, maybe pink dude. I don't know, but it's it it, it overall it could just be a, uh, a red Congo. Oh, and I just I just really love it because now I get to share these like four little Birkins um, with other people and do little trades with that. And that'll be fun. And I personally don't have a Birkin. So now I have a Birkin and I think this is really fun. It could just be a red Congo. Um, regardless, I like plants and I like having plants that I don't have and I, I just enjoy it. And then if the, and then I have this little guy right here, which I'm thinking of like eventually uh, uh, giving to my best friend. Um, he's helped me out so much with this business and so many other people have too. And, He's just super supportive in so many ways and has always been there for me. And so I just, I don't know. I always want to give like my friends like <laughs> a special little plant for me. It doesn't have to be like expensive, but it, to me, it's just like, it's special because, you know, like I put some effort and love to it. And so it's special. All right, y'all. Thank you so much for watching my vlog. I really appreciate y'all so much supporting my channel, supporting my my plant shop, and helping us grow. Thank y'all so much for watching my videos. I really appreciate y'all. I hope y'all have an amazing day wherever it is. Y'all take care out there. Peace, everybody. Bye.